Welcome to Cisco's Connected Energy Field Area Network Demonstration Overview. My name is Marty Collins. I work in the Technical Marketing Organization of Cisco's Connected Energy Network Business Unit, focused on the Field Area Network. This introduction video will provide an overview for a series of demonstrations that highlight Cisco's solutions for the Field Area Network. Accompanying this video will be a series of videos of the actual demonstrations, which will be made available for the field to use. So let's take a look. Let's start by looking at an overview of the utility's multi-service communication network focusing on the field area network. The system's broken into three functional tiers. The control center NOC tier where utility applications are hosted. The wide area network tier that provides the backhaul of communications from the field to the control center. And finally, the neighborhood area network tier where endpoints like smart meters are connected via radio frequency. At the center of the neighborhood area network and the wide area network tier is the Cisco Connected Grid Router 1240. Now let's take a closer look at each tier. Utilities depend on different applications to monitor and control the grid, and these applications are hosted and managed in the Control Center NOC Operation Center. In the demo, there are three utility-specific applications dealing with smart meter operations and distribution automation, which we will talk about a little later. In conjunction with utility-specific applications, there are network management applications from Cisco, like the Cisco Connected Grid Network Management System. CGNMS is used to provide visibility into the thousands of connected grid routers and millions of smart meters with functions such as secure zero-touch deployment, configuration management, image management, and more. All of these applications are available through the connection to the Cisco CGS2520 ruggedized Ethernet switch. Let's now look at the Field Area Network WAN tier. At the core of the Field Area Network is the Cisco Connected Grid Router 1240 which provides a utility-grade ruggedized routing platform for connecting devices in the field and routing communications over private WiMACs or public cellular networks back to the control center. The connection for the WAN could also be a fiber Ethernet connection if available, which is what is used for this demonstration. In addition to the connected grid NMS application is the Cisco tool for the field personnel to use called Connected Grid Device Manager. This tool is used to manage a single CGR1000 series router by personnel in the field with an intuitive graphical user interface. We'll cover both management applications in more detail in the full demo video. The CGR1240 has Ethernet and serial ports that can be used to connect additional devices in the field like capacitor bank controllers. In this demo, we have two cap bank controllers from partners Beckwith Electric and Cooper Power, which are connected via Ethernet running either Modbus or DNP3 over IP. This allows the utility to receive data from these devices and control the device through applications like Yukon Visual TND or CapTalk. These applications will be highlighted in the demo video. The cap bank controllers are used to ensure the grid is operating as efficiently as possible as part of an integrated volt bar control system. The final tier for the field area network we will look at is the neighborhood area network. The neighborhood area network is where wireless devices like smart meters are located. In this case, we're not talking about Wi-Fi wireless, but radio frequency mesh operating at 900 megahertz to connect the meters to the multi-service communications network using an IPv6 standards-based protocol stack. This allows the utility to both service the meter by providing connect and disconnect capabilities and read the meter data without rolling a truck to the field. In this demo, we are featuring Cisco's field area network partner, ITRON, and their OpenWay AMI solution. Within OpenWay, there is a specific head-end application called the Collection Engine, which allows the operator to perform many smart meter operational functions remotely from the control center. One of the key features we will showcase is the ability to remotely read the meter on demand. 
Another application within OpenWay allows the operator to provide remote connect and disconnect of a customer's meter service, again, without rolling a truck. This is highlighted in the demo by remotely connecting or disconnecting a meter, which has a lamp connected, and we see the lamp turn on and off. This concludes the overview of the field area network demonstration from Cisco's Connected Energy Networks Business Unit. For the most up-to-date information on Cisco's field area network solutions, please follow the link below. Thanks for watching.